Hey guys, Ezra here. Um, we've got a bit of a setup going on because I'm going to explain the damage model. Um, I'm actually doing this because it seems like people are still a bit confused about it. Um, and this is basically a response video to uh, a thread I saw on gameplay feedback, originally asking about armoring the front of higher tier vehicles. Um, but then it turns out they actually don't quite understand the whole damage model. So. Um, let me explain. Um, well, first of all, when you take a hit, you take the hit there, so that'll get destroyed. Then damage radiates, radiates out randomly in, in a circle pattern. So if it's only going to be something that would destroy four blocks, like a tier 10 SMG against tier 10 cubes, It'll radio out randomly, so do there, there, and there, we could do there, you know, different stuff like that. And then once that's full, it goes out again randomly, so do there, do there, and there, and then if that's all the damage you get taken out, then it would stop there. But it just keeps repeating until all the damage is gone. So keep filling up, and then start in the next row. Like so. It's pretty simple once it's once you actually figure it out. But I can see where it'd be a little confusing. It's not really worded all that clearly. Um, so some examples. Um, this is, all the examples are against tier 10 armor. Um, I luckily had enough cubes left over I could show. Um, well, this is a tier 10 SMG against it. It'll destroy four cubes total. And then. Uh, damage fifth. So, the red one is where you got hit, and that one's obviously destroyed, and it kind of goes out. Um, this is from a plasma. Plasma will, um, oh. Plasma will destroy 18 blocks, and then damage to 19th. And the 19th could be pretty much anywhere along the initial radius this is starting. So, be there. Yeah, all sorts of places. Then a rail. A rail will destroy 23 blocks. Damage 24th. So that's about the size we'll get. These are only 5 cube difference. That's why people say um, rails aren't really worth it in tier 10 anymore. So there's not the huge difference like there used to be. Um, and then as you can see with SMGs, it's fairly small compared to the rest. Um, let's see. Let's go ahead and do... Let's do Antique Umbrella Radiation. Yeah, let's do that next. Okay, so let's say... Oh, let, me, let me grab a gun. Um, let's say we take a plasma cannon and we hit a gun directly. That's when uh, Antique Umbrella comes in. Um, the plasma itself will only do 17,400 damage. The gun has an armor value of 18,400. So, normally what you would think, if it behaved like normal armor, it, would, it wouldn't even do anything to the block underneath. But because of the radiation, plasma sent 80% of their damage down. So that gets hit with the full force, and then this block will take 13,900 damage. So that destroys... I just imagine this block is that block. Um, so that'll destroy 14 blocks underneath it, which effectively destroys the gun. And then... destroys 14 and damages another one. Another one. Um, rails have the antique umbrella also, but they only do 50%, so that's 11,000 damage. So they're only destroying 11 blocks and damaging a, a 12th. Um, now let's do... Let's go ahead and do a little bit of Triforce example for how damage works through that. Um, it's a pretty simple setup. It's the same general setup I use when I do land ships. Um, but, I mean, it's that's a good enough model to show you guys. So let's say you take a hit from a plasma here. So that block is destroyed. And it's going to destroy 
18 total. So one, two, three, four. Um, and you see these aren't actually connected when they're like that. So it has to go sideways and down. Can't go up yet. So that's four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Now see, because of how the damage works, those two get destroyed. This one and this one, since they don't have anything holding them in place anymore, they just vanish. Damage doesn't even go to them. So then I still have two more left, and they'll have to go there. So that leaves that whole part and that inner part right there untouched. So then if I were to hit, hit right there, it would actually finish clearing that out. So instead of one hit there and just making a big hole, it actually kind of guides the damage through, which is nice. Now, referring to the thread specifically, um, he's been using tier 5 electroplating to armor the front of his uh, vehicle. Doesn't really work too well. Antique Umbrella doesn't take effect because it's not against a weapon. Because um, electroplates, they take the full damage they protect against, and then they have their own armor value, which takes damage, and then they're destroyed. Um, so let's say... Yeah, yeah. the example I used was Plasma. Let's say this gets hit with Plasma. This Electroplate only protects 5,000 damage, and then has an armor of 500. So that's a little... I'm rounding, of course. So that's a little over uh, 5,600 damage. It's protecting against. That means that's destroyed, and the plasma plasma cannon will still destroy 12 blocks underneath while damaging a 13th. So your electroplate pretty much doesn't do anything. It, it it keeps like five six blocks from getting destroyed, but you still take a big chunk. So if you were to have the tier 10, it protects 31,000 and then has an armor of 3,000. So that could actually handle um, not quite two blasts to the, to the shield. Um, but it's still a lot better than just, you know, this getting hit and just getting destroyed instantly with blocks underneath. Um, so just keep that in mind, because while it might look better, you end up just being better off with more cubes for the CPU it would use up. It's just one of those uses 36 uh, CPU. So you could have 36 more armor that would take more damage than just that one electric plate. Um, but that's the basics of it and it's really not that complicated. Um, if you guys have any more questions about it just leave a comment here on the forum like in the thread I'm posting it in, um, and I'll see if I can help you out. Thanks for watching, I hope it helped. Bye!